last thing I expected him to say. Generic control that echoes me here. Back with some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Rich today. We're watching episode 77, Loopy in the Sky with Dual Disc, which I think is a play on the song Lucy in the Sky, which is a song by the Beatles. I've actually heard that song. It's a song about tripping acid. I believe that's what the song is about. It's one of those like psychedelic songs. Um, not sure why there's a bunch of dragons flying along with uh, Kaiba's plane, but that's interesting enough. But if you want to check out my reaction episode 76, I'll leave that video right up there. Also, be linked down below in the description. Also, be playing my channel with all of my other Yu Gi Oh! Bridge reactions, including Season Zero and like the songs and uh, like little mini series and all that stuff. And uh, you all have been super helpful in the comment section and telling me about references and stuff and telling me about how the actual show went because I have not seen this part of the show. Um, shout out to the patrons as well. I wouldn't be able to do this if it was not for them. They go, they help the channel so much. and even if you're not a patron and you want to help the channel, make sure that you subscribe, like the video, and comment. Uh, I they'll love reading the comments and likes. Let me know that you are still enjoying the video, and hopefully I can make your day just a little bit better. But super looking forward to Yu Gi Oh Bridge, and I'm really looking forward to whatever a bridge show comes next because that will also be in a poll. You all gave me some great suggestions: a slap on Titan. Um, uh, code Mint, maybe. Uh, God, what's another one? I've seen SAO Bridge, so no need to comment that. I love SAO Bridge. I'll react to new episodes when that comes out. But let's not make this intro super long. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. Previously on yu gi -Oh. Breaking Bad? Never seen Breaking Bad. If you look out the window, you'll see one of the many plot holes in Season 4. Oh, sorry, that's the Grand Canyon. Hey, bro, I think the pilot Dude, might be evil. The Grand Canyon was sick. And pretend real hard. It's like I'm flying on a dragon. We this time on Yu-Gi-Oh. All the money in the world can't You're buy you a dragon. Welcome, foot fetish fans. Man alive, this desert is rough. If only we still had those other two <sighs> slaves with us. You mean Joey and Tristan? I don't bother slaves. to learn the names of my slaves, Taya. It only makes it harder to treat them with maximum disdain. Pharaoh, those aren't slaves. Those are your friends. Friends. Then why are they so Slaves. weak and useless and only ever stand around saying how great I am? Do you think I'm a slave? Taya, of course yeah. not. Okay, good, cause... Clearly you are a handmaiden. There's a big difference. <laughs> I can't believe I showed you my feet. Oh man, that's yes, a rattlesnake. Don't look too happy On the to rubber tracks. Us. What are we gonna do, Tristan? If only our master, the Pharaoh, were here, he'd know what to do. Our master. master? Yeah, you know, cause we're his slaves. When did that happen? What's going we on with our face? Our lives away face in season one. Upset. Great, and now we're gonna die as slaves by getting attacked by a snake. Actually, he says Why his is name is Cornelius a... Jr., and he just you, wants to wait. play basketball like his father always wanted him to. You can talk Corneli to snakes. Do you know anything about me? <laughs> Tristan can speak snake? Excuse me? Also, I believe a couple days ago the Yu-Gi-Oh card collection video went on. Probably on Monday, I think? Uh, over, like 10 pounds of cards. Horn Hero hey, did a great bro, job pricing sure it all out. Are you sure to fly like straight into that weird weather phenomenon? Don't worry, Mokuba. Kaiba Corp is partnered with United. They're pros. I'm sure everything will be... He hates United. Doesn't Little Creeper Don't hate United? Boned. Behold the power of the Oricalcos. I guess really? we'd better That's go magic. confront whatever villain of the week that is. Oh no! The crew Literally. has mysteriously disappeared! Whoever How? did this doesn't play by magic? the rules. Usually my enemies just kidnap you. But this guy, he kidnapped everyone except you. We are through the looking glass. Mokuba, remind me to dock the flight crew's pay for the hours they missed while being magically abducted. They weren't just abducted, Kaiba! They were what never here in the first place! What do you mean they were never here in they the first place? They were illusions created by... By me with the power of the Oricalcos. So the Oricalcos can take people's souls, make monsters turn real, and create and illusions of hundreds of people? Welcome to season four, the show where the magical powers are made up and the plot doesn't matter. I still have a clearly Kaiba being related to someone who was vaguely associated with the death of oh, my brother, God. Kaiba. Let's that plot. Duel. That story In the interest line. of safety, there is absolutely no smoking during this duel. All duel discs must be set to airplane mode. And in the likely event that I completely own your ass what? at card games. Emergency lighting will illuminate the way to the exit so you can get the hell out of my life. Is that foreshadowing? You have a button just to get rid of the furniture? Of course I do. What kind Why? of fool would play card games? Oh, that's table? fancy. What is this, the dark ages? So inefficient. You tell me, Kaiba, because once I win this duel and the seal of Arakalkos takes your soul, an age of darkness is all I can bring you your brother know. back. <laughs> Bye, Mokuba. Who's flying the plane? Actually, I guess most planes. Experiencing some 
rough air. For those of you Wait, in the Kyber Corp Airlines reward program, we'd like to once again thank you for your patience. For those of you Is not this... in the reward program, flight attendants will be by shortly to poke you with sharp objects and make passive-aggressive remarks about your appearance. Wait, are they gonna fight on top? They're gonna do it on top of the place in the very heavens themselves. What is with this show? Cool if I were dueling someone I actually cared about. It's a good thing the autopilot's engaged, or this could be seriously dangerous. Don't worry, Seto. I'll save us. No, Mokuba. Mokuba, don't. Mokuba, don't. You don't need to do that. Most planes fly themselves. These buttons look important. Automatic pilot off. Switching to manual. Warning. Plane descending too rapidly. Collision with ground image. Pick up. Oh god, what I do? Now watch as I magically force you to experience a flashback to someone else's memories, which is yet oh, okay. another thing okay, they got that the is apparently able to do. Uh -huh. Apparently. Got it. I played Lexus Duelist recently, actually. Me and my friends play it. What? What? Where am I? That smell. That disgusting, repulsive smell. I it smells recognize like poor people. that anywhere. Come on, guys. Let's get these supplies downstairs. We scavenged the heck out of this stuff. Poor people. Excuse me. How did I did you get call it? Hiding? Oh, I'm not really here. This is just an illusion created by some Arakalkos punk in the hopes that it'll somehow make me feel some sort of responsibility for how bad his life was. Let me guess. You're supposed to remind okay. me of Mokuba? Mokuba? No, mister. My name's Aaron. I'm gonna call you No. Mokuba, and our relationship nope. is going to be nothing like the one between me and my brother. Okay, mister. Shut up, Nokuba. I can't believe it's what I'm It's gonna be nothing like here. it? This is worse than I could have possibly imagined. Alistair has sent me to a place far more terrifying than the Shadow Realm. He's transported me into the plot Poor of a people. young adult novel. Nokuba, answer me. How does Nokuba. a group of children survive in a war-torn environment like this? We mostly get by using our street smarts and ingenuity. Yeah, my brother Mokuba is pretty good at handling dangerous situations too uh, he's literally crashing your plane no our hideout it's been destroyed i have to save my friends no Koopa, no no your you friends have to probably dead so you can be in the second book hunger games 2 the divergent maze runner oh no the tanks <laughs> the are here they've been hitting it's like our three different movies fire for months and now they found us there's no escape Tabacor. Uh, alistair you fool didn't anyone warn you Never bring a tank to a trading card fight! Okay. I remember those monsters. Those things are really cool. So now you finally know the pain I think I had some in my collection. I when I lost my brother all those years ago, Kaiba. No, he doesn't the at all. The guilt in your soul is as plain as the look on your face. Look, I get it, okay, Alistair? War is bad. Death is bad. My stepfather was bad. Now will you please stop beating me Step over the on. head with all this symbolism and end this pretentious charade already? The only way you're getting out of this is to face the sins of your family and accept the deep death. Down, you and the rest of humanity deserve to be wiped out. Or I could just summon my XYZ dragon cannon and yep. shoot my way out of here. That is true. Goodbye, tank. Maybe? Rainbows? Yep, oh. I guess that works just as good. You were supposed to have an epiphany about the evils of humanity! Well, instead, no. I had an epiphany about the awesomeness of my cards, which are awesome. Look at that, it's a robot dragon tank. That alone proves that humanity that is, cool. is worth saving, because we made a robot dragon tank. You've learned nothing from my heavy-handed hallucination! I guess I'll just have to beat you in a card game and take your soul! I don't think I'm gonna do I that. I play Sky Union! This allows me to sacrifice three of my bones! In Why is Kyber summoned my ultimate beast? Come forth, Air Fortress Ziggurat! My Ziggurat That's is the ultimate way weapon, too big. Kaiba, and it's That's way too big. At you. Are you kidding? There's guns all over the damn thing. What is it? It only has 2,500 attacks. That's mad it. Because my monster's design is cooler than anything it's you not. could come up with. No, I'm it's mad not. because I never wanted to know what one of Hideo Kojima's wet dreams looked like. And now I Who? do. So, thanks for that. This monster represents my Someone brother Mikey's untimely death at the hands of Kaiba Corp's military division. Look, I understand how poetic this must seem, forcing me to suffer the way your brother did, yada yada yada. But listen <laughs> to me. I am not responsible for your brother's death. Kaiba Corp doesn't even have a military division anymore. You yeah, exactly. They were all military. believe you didn't keep any of your weapons division tech lying Why? around? Why? They made more money. I swear on my life that we didn't keep a single single flying war machine of death. 
This is Kaiba Corp War Machine oh. 1 on rescue approach War with Machine. Death Squadron. How may we assist you, Mr. Kaiba? Hey, Seto, I called the War Machines of Death to come save us. No Shut up, Mokuba. Good job, Mokuba. Real big help. Yay! Go, Team Kaiba! <laughs> Alistair. Alistair. <laughs> he just sounds like PTSD no, whenever, like, a helicopter flies over. Uh, uh, also, Mokuba, I guess, but mostly the paperwork. Okay, let me guess. That monster is going to shoot down. Okay, I thought it was about to shoot How down the helicopter. To stare into the face of death, Kaiba. Well, it'd be way more intimidating if its face wasn't so damn adorable. That's the face of my brother's favorite action figure, Dinah Dude. Oh, you're right. What? Now I'm really intimidated. And speaking of your Dinah Dude, I activate Soul Exchange. This allows me to sacrifice two of your stupid robots in order to summon Blue Eyes White Dragon. Okay. What are you Fair enough. To achieve with this, Kaiba, our two monsters are. Equal in strength, thanks to the power of the each other. Alcos. So when you attack and lose your points. dragon, it'll be a simple matter of taking your life points and your soul. All thanks to the power, power of, of the, the Oracalcos. Yeah, or yeah. You seem to have forgotten that the power of the Oracalcos is absolutely nothing compared to the power of whatever the hell trading card bullshit Money? I pull out of thin air. And this time, it's my trap card, Tyrant Wing. Who needs military do? weapons of mass destruction when oh. you can just just use a good old fashioned dragon. That's an equipped spell card, I'm guessing. Blue eyes best. No, my air fortress! This isn't right, Kaiba! This whole duel was supposed to be a metaphor for the futility of war! And how everybody no. loses when they choose to destroy! Well, you got the futility and the losing parts down. <laughs> Fine! Since I can't beat you in this duel, I'm just no. going to leave and let you die in a plane crash. Oh, no, 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 hang oh, on, wait, don't rude. go! You gotta keep playing. Why? Because Why? you're doing so well. Look, you've got three monsters and I've only got one. You're a shoe in I don't know. Seems kind of like you're goading me. Trust me. A little bit. Out of all the bad guy duelists I've ever faced, you are definitely the most likely to wipe the floor with me. All right then, I end <laughs> Not my Yugi. turn. Bang of Critias. Okay. with my blue eyes. Critias? Blue eyes tyrant dragon. I should probably oh, mention, scary. Alistair, you weren't even close to beating me. But you said that you were most likely to win? That's right. All my other opponents have had a 0% chance of beating me. You had 0.1. But it was oh, a huh? big 0.1%. It is a better chance. Huge, really. Be proud of that. Infinitely now, more. Blue Eyes Tyrant Dragon, destroy all three of his monsters! Uh, how does that work? <laughs> No rules. Experiencing elevated levels of turbulence. In an emergency situation, parachutes are available for $500 a head. In case of a water landing, Kaiba Corp Airline Rewards Club members may use those passengers not in the rewards program as flotation devices. Alistair, okay. are you all right? Mikey. He has no soul. Is that really you? It is. Mikey. Oh, he's seen his brother. He's not dying. And it's all thanks to the power of the Oracle. Yeah, he's dead. Dibs on his crappy oh. broken stuff. We're going to be the crappy broken stuff if we don't safely land this plane. <sighs> Not even Autopilot. Microsoft Flight Simulator prepared me for this. This is just like that what? one recurring dream Flight Simulator's great, though. Except in the dream, I'm always saved at the last second by magical dragons, and it's the best day of my own. It's my prettiest. God. Yes, it's actually happening. Damn, you see what I'm seeing? Yes. Oh, and they're going to cross paths? Yes. Of course. Yes. He's literally being saved by three dragons. That depends. Do you see three legendary dragons helping a plane land while Seto Kaiba has what sounds like the biggest orgasm of his life? Yeah. That is so that I could not have described that better. Also, were they in a desert? How are they in a forest? Also, there was a river. Oh, hey guys, I guess we found each other. Weren't we all in the middle of the desert like five yeah. minutes ago? A plane just landed exactly where we all were with the help of three legendary dragons and that is the plot hole you're focusing on? Did you guys notice this episode had the exact same ending as B-Movie? Yes, Tristan, <laughs> we all noticed. I am now a member I... of the Mile High Club. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Kaiba. What do you think of my life? I think I expected him to say. You beat someone in a duel while you're on a plane? Actually, no. Yeah, yes, yes, kind you're of. Right. That's kind exactly of. what that is. Smile high, I get what he meant. Season 4, except every time they say Oracalco, the plot gets dumber. That's very true. Oh, man. I don't think there's anything at the end. Oh, my God. That, that might be 
that that's up there one of my favorite episodes of the entire show it's that good uh do all the plot holes they went from a desert and just oh my god season four does it did it, adults made this right and adults approved of this to be made right oh god y'all weren't kidding when see y'all said season four is just season four oh my god that was interesting to say the very least uh it's a very eventful episode. I uh, hope you stick around for episode 78. Make sure that you are subscribed. We just hit 24,000 subscribers, and I cannot thank you all enough for the love and support you've shown me through the last year with the channel being deleted and everything. Make sure you leave some suggestions down for our bridge shows that you want me to react to next. Uh, they'll be in a poll, and you can all vote for them once we get done with the Go Bridge. Might have a couple little like uh, videos here and there for Yu Go Bridge that come out, and then we'll jump into the next bridge. But Final Fantasy VII, Machina Bridge, a uh, slap on Titan. Um, Maybe Pokemon Abridged, Naruto Abridged, maybe. Um, I don't know. I can only do like five or six at a time. So let me know which ones you want to see the most. And I guess that's how I will decide which ones make the cut to get into the poll. But like I said, I really hope that you're subscribed. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully I made your day just a tiny little bit better. Hope to see you next one. But until then, cue the music. We were playing.